Have you seen what's happening at the southern border of the U.S.? It is a topic of immense significance, a topic that intertwines the threads of human rights, economic policy, and international cooperation. We often hear about the colossal sums of money spent on barriers, like the U.S. southern border wall. Did you know that in the last six years alone, an estimated $15 billion was poured into this project? This equates to roughly $5,000 per immigrant based on the average number of people crossing the border over the same time period. But what if we redirected our focus and our funds? What if we chose to build bridges of opportunity rather than walls of separation? Could this proposed system work? Imagine a world where this staggering $15 billion is invested not in concrete and steel, but in hope and opportunity. A world where we acknowledge that people usually leave their homes not out of choice, but necessity. They seek better lives, escaping poverty, violence, or lack of opportunity. Let's envision a different approach. What if we invested this money in the countries from which these immigrants originate? Let's dive into what this could look like. Education is a powerful tool for change. Investing in schools, particularly in rural and underserved areas, can create a brighter future. This means not just constructing buildings, but ensuring access to quality teaching, materials, and technology. By creating vocational training centers, we can equip individuals with the skills needed in today's global economy. Skills that empower communities to build, innovate, and thrive. Small business grants and microloans can stimulate local economies. This empowerment leads to job creation and, crucially, a sense of community ownership and pride. Establishing accessible healthcare facilities can drastically improve the quality of life, reducing one of the primary reasons people feel compelled to leave their homes. Many immigrants come from agrarian societies. Modernizing agriculture with sustainable practices can increase productivity and food security, anchoring families to their ancestral lands. Now, a critical component of this vision is accountability. The implementation of these programs requires rigorous oversight. We propose the establishment of an independent, international agency dedicated to ensuring that every dollar is accounted for, minimizing corruption, and maximizing impact. As we stand at this crossroads, we have a choice. We can continue to fund walls, a symbol of division and isolation, or we can invest in the foundation of a more connected, prosperous world. The choice is ours. In conclusion, let's choose to build not just a future for ourselves, but for all those who share this planet with us. Let's choose bridges of cooperation over walls of segregation. Let's invest in humanity. Thanks for watching this video, share and comment so we can keep the converse stand moving along.